Welcome to another PS3 hacking video. This is going to be on the 3.55 custom firmware. This was just released a few days ago by Geohot. He's, I guess, back in the scene now. And this is a custom firmware he made. Now, just a few things right up front. First off, watch the whole video before you go doing this just to make sure you understand everything. You don't want to be halfway through and realize that you don't have a flash drive and finish the rest or something like that. So just watch this entire video first. Make sure you back up all your stuff. Something could go wrong. It's not likely, but it's possible. So just make sure you have all your stuff backed up, all your save data, everything like that. And so basically this is just a custom firmware that lets you just boot up your console without the use of a calculator or a droid or anything like that. No USB device is necessary. You just hit the power button and you're up to a jailbroken console. And also, just one last reminder, this does not let you play your backups. Uh, if you have any backups on an external hard drive such as this, they won't work. The, you, and all homebrew has to be re-signed, which means it needs to be, I don't, I don't think it needs to be completely rewritten, but it has to be um, updated to work with the newest firmware. So there's only a few apps out as of today, which is I believe the 9th of January 2011. And those are like the FTP server. I think the SNES emulator has a very beta, maybe even like an alpha-ish release. So the uh, the range of homebrew right now is limited. And like I said, your backups will not work yet. But I bet within a week, we'll be all up and running just fine. So you're going to need a computer for this. You could be, I think you're going to need a flash drive. And that's pretty much it. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so here I am at my PS3. And um, I'm up, I'm running 3.41 at the moment, and so the first thing you have to do is you have to update to 3.55 official firmware. I know it sounds weird, but that's what you do. So go ahead and go to System Update, update via Internet or Storage Media if you have a 3.55. So as you can see here, 3.55, official right through software update or System Update rather. Please wait. And it's going to give you all the mammo jammo and you want to go ahead and start and I'll be back when this is done okay for the next step you're going to need a USB flash drive an external hard drive will work anything that's USB based will work so it's I have mine right here it has to be formatted to FAT32 right here as you can see so all you have to do is create if you don't have one already I do just create a folder called PS3 and now within that, you're going to need to create a folder called Update, all capital letters. If it's not capital letters, it won't work. So make sure it's all capitals. In this Update folder, you're going to have to put a file. There's a link in the description where to get it. It's right here. This is, this is where the link will take you. And you're going to need to download this. Click here. Or you could just go to geohot.com. But either way works as long as you get to this page. And where it says it's jailbreak time, just download that. I'll go ahead and save it to my desktop. Okay, so now you have the zip file right here. So to open it, just go ahead and double click it. It'll go ahead and extract in this ps3 update.pub file. That just goes right in there, right in the update folder. And that's all you need to do. So now you want to go ahead and unplug your flash drive and back to the ps3 we go. Okay, so here I am at the PS3, which is now running 3.55. I'll show you that now. Hopefully you guys can make that out. 3.55. So the thing, what you want to do now is you want to take the USB stick that you have that um, pop on, that three PS3 update where you created the folders, and you want to go ahead and put that in any USB port on your PS3. Once that's in a USB port, you want to go up to System Update via Storage Media. And as you can see here, it found 3.55 JB, obviously stands for Jailbreak. And we'll hit OK. Now here's a license agreement. This really isn't a license agreement. This is just kind of like GeoHot's little thing. It's kind of funny to read. <laughs> So you can go and have some fun reading that. So I'm going to hit accept and go ahead and start the update. As you can see, it goes very fast. This isn't, isn't like a full system update. It's just a very little file. You know, only the system is shut down. You'll see the red LED up there. So then after that, all you have to do is just hit the power button. 
and then you're jailbroken. There's no more calculator, there's no more PS jailbreak dongle. All you have to do is hit the power button and you're hacked and good to go. Now like I said at the beginning, this does not support um, black backups or anything like that and all homebrew has to be pretty much rewritten. But other than that, you have your installed package files. For instance, I have, this is Open Manager, this is, this is a backup manager. If I try to install this, it won't work. So, there are, like I said at the beginning of this video, there are a few things like the SNES emulator and stuff like that that will work. But, as far as this stuff, this won't run. None of your previous homebrew will run. You just have to download them. And in the link I put in the video description from earlier, there's a, there are a few apps on that site that have been rewritten, so you can go ahead and check those out. But just to prove one more time, I'm on 3.55. There you are. Custom firmware, 3.55. And you are able to log into the PlayStation Network. Do a quick test of that now. And there you are. There you are on a hacked console signed in into PlayStation Network. So I hope you guys found this video useful. A thumbs up would be greatly appreciated. Please uh, subscribe, comment, video response, stuff like that. I'm open for questions. I'm at CPU Kid on Twitter if you have any other questions or concerns or comments or anything else. And that's pretty much it. So thanks for watching.